today I'm going to talk about hip mobility. This seems to be quite an area of opportunity among a lot of students here and elsewhere. So if you have issues getting into the bottom of the squat or staying in the bottom of the squat, it is likely because you don't spend enough time in the bottom of the squat. So here are some things you can do at the bottom of your squat. First, you want to make sure, of course, your whole foot is on the ground and you're keeping a very tall chest. From here, I can sink down a little lower and get comfortable and press my knee away from my arm. You want to get as much range of motion here as possible on both sides. Getting really comfortable sitting in the bottom of the squat. Another thing you can do to help get more comfortable down here is grabbing your opposite ankle and opening your chest. Down and up on both sides of your squat. If you do eight to 10 reps on either side, you will have greater range of motion in the bottom of your squat.